Hello and welcome to episode 322 of Geeking Out. I'm Jim, and last time we took a look at the Legend of Korra Turf Wars, today we're taking a look at Miraculous. So, let's get into it, shall we? This is Miraculous, number one, written by Brian Seaton, with art by Brian Hess. When Adrian outplays a lacrosse player, Hawk Moth akumatizes him, turning him into replay. He gains the ability to control time around him. So, will Ladybug and Cat Noir be fast enough to defeat him, or will he stop their heroics with a penalty shot? So that's what happens in the first issue of Miraculous. Now let's get into the good and the bad. Alright, so if you're not a fan of Miraculous, this one might turn you off just a little bit because there is no real uh, telling of the characters or where, how the story has gone so far. So you're kind of left without any knowledge of what's been happening or who these characters are. You're expected to know who these characters are. So unless you're a Miraculous fan, you're going to be a little lost. Alright, so other than that, the story I know here is okay. Uh, it's fun for fans of the show as it features new stories and characters. Uh, it does, however, feel quite a bit rushed at parts and the art does fluctuate a tiny bit. Uh, so unless you're really a big fan of the TV series Miraculous and I am. It's actually a really fun Sailor Moon-esque series. I've been enjoying quite a bit. Uh, this might be for you, and if you have anyone, little ones, trying to get into comics or whatnot, this is also a not a bad read either. So check it out if you get a chance. It's not terrible, and it certainly isn't doing any harm. So join us next time, however, as we take a look at There's Nothing There and September Morning. We will see you next week. Join us next week for There's Nothing There and September Morning.